Hey, what's up, guys? We're back here with another video. In this video, we're going to go over the top, uh, not top six. We're going over the third quest in 6.4 from the beta. So, in order of hardest node, just because the six path says, you know, I have six packs in every quest, hardest or easiest to hardest. So, the first node here is literally just aggression and cruelty. This node, and it has 100% choose strike, choose strike, which doesn't really matter that much at all. So this node is basically not even a node. So this is like I would say probably the easiest path for most people. So yeah, that's pretty much path one in a nutshell. Just aggression cruelty. So as long as you don't get hit, you'll be fine. Now I move on to path number two, which is a whole bunch of irrelevant nodes. The only relevant node is inflicts poison, and then you start with like a heal block. So if you're running a someone who do, who takes bleed damage and you might take a little bit of damage in the beginning of the fight but basically all you really need here is a poison immune preferably double immune if you're running suicide so you don't take so much damage from the um the heal block and the p bleeds in the beginning so all you really need is a poison immune and this path is pretty easy so yeah just poison immune and that's it now we move on to the third hardest lane um this one uh, this one is just a gr um clap back so basically you want to use any champion that doesn't deal debuffs because if you put a debuff on them, unless you're immune to it also, like for example, Sunspot is immune to um, Incinerate, so he'll work fine to this. But you want to use anyone who doesn't div, um, give debuffs really because he'll just give, give it back to you. And this gameplay in the background is kind of scrub like, I know, but that's pretty much all you need for this. Um, uh, this one is just a, um, what's it called? A character like Corvus or Ghost, just anyone who doesn't do like deal de de um, deal their damage with debuffs, and you'll be fine. So yeah, third hardest node, clap back. Now we move on to, in my opinion, the fourth hardest. This is when it starts actually getting difficult. So this one basically has spite and stun immunity, so you can't stun them. And then if you ever have a buff, they'll be gaining eighteen percent of their power. So like you just want to ghost this really. Like the next like few, I think the next three lanes, number one character is ghost for all three of them because she doesn't have any buffs really. If you're going for like the one-hit combos, I used Corvus for this fight, but I, I have that little buff on me, that like purple thing, and this mixed with Mysterio, who's the first opponent, is not a good time because as you can see, he's just gonna keep doing special ones, and I want people to get my ins in because I'll keep having the damage reflect thing. So yeah, this is definitely the fourth hardest. I wouldn't take this as your first pass for completion. I'd say it's Spite, and Spite's not fun in any node. Plus, stun immunity, so you can't stun him. So, yeah, definitely fourth hardest lane in this quest. So, for this next lane, this is the fifth hardest out of the six. It's definitely the second hardest or fifth on the list, I guess. But this one basically has 90% crit um, re um, reduction. And then it has stunning reflection, which is a node that if you parry, basically, or give a stun in any way, it'll reflect back to you. So, it's basically stun immune. But if you mistake and stun, it's worse than stun immune, I guess. So, you can't parry at all. And plus the 90% critical reduction. It's not crit damage. So you, you can still use your Corvuses or whatever. But for this lane, I would honestly just say Ghost. For the guaranteed crits, you, like, the, you need someone that can deal crits. Because it'll have 90% crit reduction. And the stun node. So it's like a harder stun immune, no crit lane. It's kind of, and of annoying. Also, the first character is pun um, Punish 29. So this is definitely the fifth hardest on the list. Fifth hardest lane to go down. So yeah, let's go down to the final lane. Now we move on to the final lane. This is definitely the hardest lane in my opinion by far, only because there's like so little counters. 200% power gain. Plus, they're gonna go. They're not gonna use any special, but they're special threes basically. It's gonna be. They're gonna start, use the special three first, then their special two, then their special one, and then restart. I guess. So you're gonna be eating the special three, and I'm pretty sure the only character that can counter this really is Ghost or like Magneto, but Magneto wouldn't really work that well. So this is like Ghost. If you want to do this lane, you're going to pretty much just need Ghost because it's pretty terrible with anyone else. I tried it with Corvus because I don't have Ghost. And I couldn't make it that far because 200% power gain. He uses a special two. You do sur I did survive it, but then he used his... Um, but then, you know, with the 200% power gain, you go straight back up to another special three so fast. It's like this lane is just not fun, I would say. This is like definitely the hardest lane by far just because there's like so few counters for this. So yeah, definitely the hardest lane. Now let's move on to the boss. Now we move on to the Dark Hawk boss. This guy is kind of a pain. He has this node where he starts off in his null form, which is um basically his damage form. Plus he has unblockable like lights and mediums. He got hurt locker, trial by fire, 
and then spiked armor, and then power reserve on top of all of that. So, with trial by fire, if you don't hit him every like few seconds, you get the incinerate. I think the incinerate's pretty weak, so I don't think that's a big deal. It's just this um, unblockable mode in the beginning, which is medium and light attacks are unblockable, plus the um. 50% special reduction because he's gonna be throwing off a lot more specials and dark Hawk doesn't have the most fun specials um, And spiked armor on top of that. So every time you crit you take damage this boss eh, Out of the last two probably the hardest but still I will say the axic axix bosses There's nothing like BS if you know what I mean like this node is definitely a hard this fight could be BS, but like you can just try to like tank your way through it. Um, like right here, just one life Corvus. I got like that much down. So yeah, that's the boss, and yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Get a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.